Hey guys, welcome to 2023. So happy new year wherever you are. And um by now you you know you've been with me if you've been with me since the start. I have been, you know, been with YouTube as a content creator for around two years already. Uh more than two years probably. And um Let's talk about the changes that I wanted to, you know, to bring to you guys. My plans for, they, they aren't really changes, but they're more additions. Not really, you know, um, toning it down, but making it more, you know, uh, improving it from what we have right now. Um, I've had some time to think about it um, over the holidays. That is why I haven't been making content because I've been thinking on what would the community like for me as a content creator what would they want moving forward um what how do i want to project myself as a content creator i'm i'm, I'm i the serious type am i just the you know the part time content creator but moving forward um there are certain changes in my life that has freed me up from other responsibilities that um, um, that I really decided to pursue this with more time. Okay, so let's start off with the, the things that I would want to talk to you guys about is number one, there is going to be a rebranding of the channel. Okay, so part of the rebranding is going to be the name. It's not going to be far off. Okay, so just a little bit of rebranding, keeping it kind of simpler. And also the logo, of course, because you're going to be changing the name. So those are uh, those are parts of the rebranding. And also with the rebranding comes with a little bit of more of content. So on the content side, you're going to be expecting from me the usual, you know, gaming content guides, of what I bring to day-to-day um, -to -day content for the channel. And also, I'm going to include... I'm going to start this off as a mini-series. So, it's going to be content creator tips, uh, particularly in gaming. Um, I've, 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 uh, I've, I've sent out a poll last year whether you guys are interested. Um, I think around 60, or 60 to 70 are interested in content creator tips, how to start a gaming channel. So I'm going to start this off as a mini series. Um, if there is really um, interest, a growing interest from the community, then I would put it side by side with the gaming content. Of obviously, um, the gaming content will really, really be there. That is my core. The content creator tips is actually just a, you know, um, one of the things that I wanted to help with the community. So rebranding content. Third is going to be uh, which games I'm going to be carrying for next year. So right now, I so far, the ones that I've carried were um, Figure Fantasy, Path to Nowhere, Ecocalypse. So those are the three. But moving forward, um, there are is kind of a bit of a shakeup in terms of the games. So main games would be Archland. I'm preparing for Archland. Um, I'm actually playing already in the Korean server. I haven't uploaded any videos because I'm doing an extensive review of the game and I kind of really like it because it's kind of like Final Fantasy Tactics. We're in um, I grew up on that game, and uh, I'm actually very interested in playing it. So Archland is one of my main games moving forward. Starting tomorrow, I'll be creating content um, based on the Korean server, which is an English translation. Um, I'm going to make guides um, how to play you know, the, the, the usual shebang. And also, I'm waiting for the global launch of Higan Eruthil as part of my main game. So moving forward, Arsland and Higan and Ruthel will both be my main games. I'm dropping Ecocalypse, um, definitely, because um, it at this point, I think I've exhausted, you know, my, uh, my, uh, exhausted my ways of creating content for the game. 
it's it's it the content there is really repeat recycle so no avenues for new content or unique content so i'm dropping ecocalypse i'm going to maintain however figure fantasy and path to nowhere um so basically i'll be playing four games four main games higan eruthil archland figure fantasy path to nowhere for figure fantasy um there will be a little bit of a drop off in terms of content because i feel that also the game has been repetitive as well i'm going to cover updates for figure fantasy cover guides for unique content but for the repetitive content um i i won't you know create any more for figure fantasy just the updates and the unique content that they put out and collabs of course uh, anything interesting new for figure fantasy definitely i'll cover um again um figure fantasy has been my game for 2022 uh i'm gonna continue covering it um i still like the game but again it has been the same ever since the content that they bring out i still love the game uh but i need to be able to cover other games as well that i love so I'm, you know, I'm putting it um, as part of my my secondary game, probably, or my third game for Figure Fantasy. Path to Nowhere, um, also a secondary game, uh, not much content after, you know, when, when they do updates. So, Figure Fantasy and Path to Nowhere will be both games that are on the secondary. Primary will be Higan, Ruthil, and Archland. So, I hope you understand why I'm doing this. I want to create I, I want to focus on games wherein number one it uh, it's more interest it it keeps me you know uh, interesting games that keeps me um you know wanting more and not only that they're new like for example Archland it's up my alley of what I've been used to playing uh before and also for Higan Ruthil it's a for me it's unique it's it it needs attention as well as for uh, from creators so that is why i'm covering higan eruthil as well so that is it for the games that i'm going to be covering for the channel and um number four is going to be memberships so as part of my, my you know my additional income stream for the channel i'm going to be activating my memberships for youtube um for those of you guys who want to support me um this would be a very very um great opportunity and also this would really bolster um part of the thrust that i would want to do um i would want to go in on, on youtube but again um uh, creating videos um setting up you know setting up your um your recording you know system uh putting up a set whatever i actually plan to put up a set eventually uh with a good background the background right now is just simple i just blurred it out i don't have anything for the background but once i have you know i have generated uh more income for you know the channel then definitely a lot of things will improve especially for the visuals for this um for this uh for the content for you know everything so again memberships are there for those who think that um my channel gives them you know more uh, my channel gives them value um please do support my channel through the memberships i'll be launching it soon so rebranding and memberships will be you know will be hand in hand hopefully this this january um but again i do hope you guys um help me uh, what do you call this? Help me, support me with the membership. Um, membership, what do you call this? Membership platform that I'm actually launching this January. Okay. And also, um, number five as well, I'm still going to continue game reviews for those who, for those games that are coming out. Um, like, for example, Withering Waves. Reverse 1999, Project Snow, Harry Potter Magic Awakened, Zenless, Zone Zero, Honkai Star Rail, Girls Frontline Exilium. Um, these games 
I'm going to be reviewing plus other games that are coming, which are interesting. Um, the games that I'm looking forward to in particular is or are Girls Frontline Exilium and Honkai Star Rail plus Zenless Zone Zero. So those are, you know, the games that I I am watching out for. Um, doesn't mean that I'm going to cover them. I'm interested in playing them. It really depends on how the progression is. Again, the end game. Um, that is why that is why I I'm interested in Archland and Higan Ruthil because of the progression in the end game. So again, those are the things that are going to be part of the channel for this year. Oh, before I forget, I plan also to I don't know when. But this is the last uh, thing that I'm going to be launching this year for the for the channel. It's going to be merchandise. Hopefully, I could put out merchandise um, within this year. Uh, also, to to support the channel. So, memberships to support. Uh, merchandise to support. But merchandise, again, probably that will happen late first quarter of this year. So, so far, those are the plans. So, a lot of changes, a lot of things happening this year for the channel. I've given, I'm going to give the channel more time. Uh, again, uh, for those who, you know, forgot what I said earlier, I have more time this year for the channel. And my plan is to, you know, make the channel bigger than it is right now, especially, you know, especially moving forward. And um, I hope that, um, I hope that I can take this big step. So, I it's really up to you guys if you want to support me. Um, hopefully, making um, content creation will be my main source of income in the future. Hopefully, because I want to do this. I'm passionate on doing this. I just needed more time before. And now that I have more time, then I'm actually really confident that I can take the big step with you guys. But without all of you, um, this channel wouldn't be... You know, successful. Um, I am thankful for 2022 for all the support that you've given me. Um, somehow, this is also a thank you video for, or for you know, you you put me from a 1,000 subscriber channel to a 5,000 subscriber channel. So, a big leap from 1,000 to 5,000 for 2022. Really, really want to say my thank you to everybody. That is why I'm doing this. That is why I'm putting more effort to the channel because I want you guys to enjoy more of my content, to enjoy uh, more quality content. Because again, um, the only thing that's holding me last year was time. Now that I can devote more time to you guys, to the channel, then the doors will be open. Okay, so hopefully... Um, that answered your question on the changes. It's not really a bad change. It's going to be changed for the better. I just hope that you also, you guys have, you know, you, you have the same thoughts as me. So put your comments down um, on what you think on the changes for this year for the channel, and um, particularly on the games. So um, especially for those who have been with me for the figure fantasy community. Um, I hope that you guys are not saddened by, you know, me pushing, pushing figure fantasy probably to a secondary game, my primary and switching to other games as my primary game. So I hope, and I apologize for doing that. But again, um, there has little, there has been little contact for content for figure fantasy that it left me no choice but again to put it on the secondary spot and put other games on the primary spot so that is it um looking forward to the two games that i mentioned arkland and uh higan ruthil path to nowhere as well i'm still excited about the game um and that is it so hopefully guys tomorrow expect more content or more new content from me um, I'll be previewing other games if they're worth playing, you know, for this year. So watch out for that. So thank you very much, guys, for staying this far from 2020 up to 2023. So hope you stick around more. Um, invite your friends. 
um, share my channel to your friends and hopefully you stick around for more content from your warden. Okay. Thank you guys. Happy new year and stay safe.